We are live, live, live. Yari belly is live. Live in the kitchen and live with the cooking. Live, live, live. Yari belly is live. Yari belly TV. Live, live, live. Cooking, cooking, cooking. Yari belly is cooking. Cooking in the morning, we're cooking in the evening. Cooking, cooking, cooking. Yeah, the belly is cooking. Yeah, the belly TV is cooking, cooking, cooking. Cheese and peas, that sound good now, official Jamea. Good morning to you. Delana Brown, big up yourself, you. Morning, to big up, big up, big up. It is a beautiful Thursday morning. And let us first and foremost ask you, as soon as you join us, please drop a thumbs up. We appreciate love it. And today we are going hot cuisine. Hey, hey. Mm -hmm. Yes, I see. We're going hot cuisine. Hot cuisine. All right, so guys, before we start the food cooking thing, um, thank you guys for sticking and staying and supporting us. Um, there's been many, many little challenges along the way. Not major challenges, sorry, sorry. Not major challenges, but many little challenges. And so Thursday, we did not post. Tuesday, um, Tuesday sorry, we did not post. And uh, my apologies for that. Um, it's all on me because to be honest with you guys, sometimes it's challenging to, to post, um, you know, everything. Sometimes we really don't want to eat anything. Um, and because we don't, I, I have been struggling not struggling, but I've been in that weight issue time. We have been avoiding, I have been avoiding the excessive amount of cooking and the excessive amount of food. So, I'm going to just bear with me, okay? Okay. Okay. All right. So, that's why we didn't cook on Tuesday. I was watching her, she was watching me, and we were both saying, should we? Could we or can I bother? And and trust me, sometimes it just it's a whole lot of stuff. And and you want to come up with creative recipes and new recipes and you know, babes, where where the, where the tomato something? Where's the where's the container for this? Combo? Oh the, the, the part the part for this. Yeah, so may I tell you guys. Um, you would not, you would be surprised to think that, you know, people who, you have to eat every day, right? And you still can't find nothing to eat. <laughs> or of worth, you know? <laughs> Good morning, Dion Banks. It, did I get your name right? Is it Dion? Um, you, you, you'd be surprised. You'd think that because people have to eat every day. We're gonna find something to eat. Nope. Doesn't work like that. Doesn't work like that. You know, good morning, prayer kid. We need more soup to help with the issues. Prayer kid, I want to tell us that we're planning to do some wolf of soup, you know. Um, Paulette Francis, good night. I think you are may, you may be over in the European side of life. Good morning to you. Where where it's morning here? Yeah. You two inspired me last video. I tagged you on. You, uh, inspired my last video. I tagged you on it. Thank you so much, official Jamia. I'm gonna go check. And I'm, I did not get any notification. You know, you got any notification from official Jamia's last video? No. No, we didn't. We didn't get any notification. So we have to check that out. But What's going on? We, we have been. You know what? I haven't been getting any YouTube notifications. YouTube's me been. Personally. YouTube's been been. No, I they've been YouTube dropping YouTube. the ball. My phone no, I'm talking about in general because people not getting my notifications oh. and we're not getting other people's notifications. So yeah. So guys, as this the title suggests today, I am doing one long name something, but it's just the easiest way to describe what I am doing. I don't think I've seen this video anywhere, but I think it can work and so I am going to do it. Today I'm using um, fresh cod fillets. Now, my fresh cod, and guys, I must tell you about this. If you love Jamaican saltfish, you can avoid that um, excessive sodium 
you can avoid the excessive dryness of the meat and all of that having to soak meat and do all of that by using replacing it with fresh cod and fresh cod comes in fillets you know um at the store yeah comes in fillets and so you can use those those fillets you know <laughs> paul it says she made mistake good morning enram good morning to you you can use those fillets to your advantage let me switch this around so look at this this is fresh cod fillets all right and i got them at my local fishmonger for six dollars for how much how much come another package the babe hmm? how much pound of fish come another package there's just two pounds two pounds six dollars for the two pounds and um this is about eight pieces right and what i've done here is i've i've marinated them uh, just a little bit um using the way well, i look up in the air for one thing i get mad in here tell me if i get mad so me can get a, a, a pack of my love for you mm. one the light no right or what what talk to me oh you're you worried me not my name me worried in the house you know oh. because me i wonder if you get mad or something <laughs> you sure mm. how much finger me have up <laughs> so i use some squid um fish sauce which is you know you, everybody have to get used to squid and i we have our extra virgin olive oil here that i drizzle on it and um i put some black pepper and that's pretty much about um it this the fish sauce has enough salt to make this something salt so you know i want to do that and then because you're poaching it you really don't want to you know extra up the thing all right so now may I, may I cut up some stuff oh by the way these are the stuff that we're gonna mm. be putting with our poached fish mm -hmm. all of these are going on it you know some some cruciferous uh vegetables um brussels sprouts carrots and we have some asparagus here and onion and then we have some also some baby tomatoes you call them pretty jeans oh, um, that's cool man my girl remember says hot mm -hmm. cuisine you know you have to remember says hot cuisine, cuisine. You understand? So guys, if you want to see how this do, we're expecting, let me see, 15 people in the chat. Mm -hmm. we, we need five more thumbs up. Guys, you have you guys uh, ever poached fish? Is that something that you guys do? I've never done it. Because they're poachers. So I'm going to learn today. Poaching fish is, is just another term for boiling it. But you, you're not going to, you're going to reduce the heat so that the, the pot is not boiling while the fish is in there. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? And then you allow it to just cook in the in the residual heat and you know you intensify the flavors by just adding your stuff as it goes along all right so i have some garlic here and guys be careful when you're not cut me and nobody taught me to cut me just sit down and watch other people the chef them cut and i may try my thing so Please remember, I'm not a professionally taught chef. I'm just very, very um, enthusiastic about food. That's it. All right. That's that. That's the that's the chief sum of my credibility. Paula says so she made a mistake. She really meant good morning, not good night. <laughs> oh, tell her I said the same thing. Good morning, mm -hmm. Paula. All right. So. Winsome Johnson, good morning to you. Good morning. Good, good morning. morning. Delano Brown said, I've done it. Okay, you've poached um, fish before. So Delano, you, you, am I on the right track? Like how you poach fish, you can tell me. Am I on the right track? You know, um, let me show you my, what, my, what my poaching entails. Come over here, boo. So I have on my stove some lemongrass. And to the lemongrass, I added some um, ginger. All right, so now mm. I am just gonna add my fish. You notice I bring the stove down to bring the, the heat down, and I'm just gonna add my fish on top of this. The lemongrass smell good, though. So, the lemongrass and the ginger is just to uh, infuse just flavor. Infuse flavor. She is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> now, 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 Delano, like when you're on the line, I could ask you this Should I add a little bit of my fish sauce? To yeah, no, make it stay. Me not add the fish sauce. Me just go, just pour the marinade. Yes, Winsome, the very same thing as fever grass. Jamaicans call it call it fever grass. 
But the um the right name is no no the, the the lemongrass or fever grass in uh, you know coining the phrase from our Jamaican island is mostly used in Asian cuisine. You understand over so. Oh. So the fever grass can just you know add little variety to it. Them use it for cook with them, put it in a rice, then put it in a different types of meats, and so yeah, you know. Look how that look, man. We just because remember this is a fillet, and this one of the things about the fillets are is that these are very, very um firm, you know, because this is what them use to, to replace saltfish. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of firm. You understand? So you have to know how to utilize it, you know, to the best of your ability. Mm -hmm. So that's why I mean uh, do not more than just poach it. And then when we're done, now, I throw in the, the marinade, which is the olive oil and the something. Mm -hmm. And just allow that to just do it still. Winsom Johnson. Okay, we're happy to have you on the chat, Winsom. She says she always watch but never um, write in. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, Winsom. Thank you, thank you. I always say you win some and you lose some, but in this case, we are all winners. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, so anybody can guess what we're having the poached fish this morning. If you can guess what we're having the poached fish with this morning, then you get one of the fish fillet. <laughs> yeah, the first person to guess the right answer, get a meal. Mm -hmm. Cover back the pot, man. Yeah? Oh. Ooh, another level, next level thing. So let me know, um, Delano, if me, if me on the right track, I'm going to bring it up again. So try to get it just to a, a boiling point, And then from there, we reduce it and make the, the fish do its thing. So that's the poaching aspect of it. See mm -hmm. there? Love it. <laughs> fish as no, not dumplings. <laughs> Delano, nope, not mashed potatoes. Delano, gone. no, you will say art cuisine. I got to throw them out. Mm -hmm. Guys, don't pay attention to my cake. Just saying. <laughs> Show them the cake. Don't pay attention to my carrot banana cake. Yes. Mm-hmm. Touch it, touch it, see. Make them see it's springy. <laughs> and a video for this recipe is coming up on Yard TV, so stay tuned for that. Mm -hmm. Stay tuned. The cake bud. Remember. <laughs> Yam and green boiled bananas. No. <laughs> Rice and peas. No. <laughs> you have to remember, remember the craving side of the whole thing. You understand? The regular side, which is the yard <laughs> side. <laughs> all right. So, all right. So, babes, you can go and start that while I just cut up. I'm just going to just slice these in half and then make some sweet, quick cuts um, to, to make the vegetable ready. All right. Mm -hmm. And by the way, check out my shirt. Uh huh. Check out my shirt. Mister, check out my shirt. Check out my shirt. Mister, check out my shirt. Check out my shirt. Mister, check out my shirt. Hey, my shirt. And this Where's says, "Wait at the top, Jam Down, Jamaica, Jam Rock." Yeah. Yadi lifestyle. Yadi lifestyle. And you can yeah. get this. If you click the shop now page, you can get this shirt and many more like it. So the whole are independent. I'm not stop, I'm not, I'm not keep this until independence done. Mm -hmm. So And guys, you already better design this. Remember me tell you. Because I'm a designer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> nice. And and nothing the panda back, nothing on the panda back. Nothing on me. Oh, alright. <laughs> Don't look on the back. Alright, guys. So let's go over here for a minute, a quick minute. For our promo hour. Our promo hour. Just make sure do that no one gets out of way so that when the art cuisine part start. Winsome Johnson, good morning. You still have the red seam pants? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, I still have the red seam pants. Thank you. The police looking pants? Yes. The one when I come with the MC inner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and somebody you know person? <laughs> Guys. The lighting won't let me be great, but yeah. So move uh, to the no. other side. Uh. Hmm? Move to somewhere else. Uh. It's 
still not great. Anyway, guys, so this morning we, we are bringing you our. You can stand in us, you can move the chairs and stand. Mm -mm. Still the same lighting. Yeah, but I'm saying for convenience, you can move the chair and stand. I'm conveniently sitting now. <laughs> so guys today we're bringing you yes our product line yes our very own one true natural product line 100% organic 100% natural you know 100% everything that's good for you mm -hmm. and one true natural as we said before is um, created by us yes and our products are only the best quality we have some hair products so far in our line and we just ventured into body care or skin products so let's start with the hair yes and this is the very very first product this this was the loan product that we created first and then from there on we just you know ran with it so this is our nourishing oil blend you guys and this is a blend of only the most the most beneficial the most nourishing the best the most favorite test just just say what it is that's the bombest <laughs> oil ever on the market so these oils guys they are you know carefully blended together so that it is um great for your hair regardless of your hair type this oil will be um suitable because it's not too heavy and it's not too light some people's hair can't take the heavy oil some people can't take the, the the light oils because their hair is probably too thick so this is perfectly blended together so that it is suitable for everybody and you guys if you guys are looking to you know see your hair look healthier and look more nourished you can use this for a hot oil treatment you can use it for scalp massages, for sealing in the moisture, which will make your hair softer for longer, and just to add shine, right? And guys, mm -hmm, our next product is our Jamaican Black Castor Oil, as I always share. This is our top seller. Yes, the top seller of the line is the Pure Jamaican Black Castor Oil. And this oil comes from the castor nut the castor seed and the jamaican castor seed the jamaican one mm -hmm. and it's an interesting process and we are, are have been sharing highlights of the process so if you guys would like to you know see footage of the the process of making this oil so you can see how nice and organic and you know authentic it is you can you know go to our instagram page one true natural so that you can see those clips but yeah this oil is great for growing your hair for thickening your hair if you have you know any kind of balding going on if you have any but kind of ball yesterday and you never give an oil. You're a ball? Yeah. <laughs> if you have any type of shedding if you have issues with your edges which is you know unfortunately a very common um, problem in our community our women are losing their edges like there is no tomorrow mm -hmm. and if you guys catch it early you can you know literally reverse you know the curse and restore those edges because you don't want it to get to a place where you actually lose the hair permanently you know to the point where the follicles are just not doing what they're supposed to do so you what want are, to what are follicles follicles are those um the pores the the oh. the, the, the root of, oh, okay. yeah mm -hmm. the root you want to attack the um the hair at the root of the problem before it's too late i'll tell you guys cooking in the morning vera mcintosh you you that we soon show you what we're cooking we are making poached fish in the morning here yes believe it or not and i don't think anybody got the plantains nope nope nobody got um the answer to what we're eating it with somebody was close but nobody got the real answer yeah so our jamaican black castor oil you guys yes salt free hexane free no additives no other oils you know um, added to to this here castor oil and it's just amazing 
We also have fried dumplings. Nope. We also have our castor oil mascara. Mm -hmm. Another issue in our community is that because of the wearing of false lashes mainly, we are losing our lashes daily. Every time you put on a strip of lash and you take it off back, you know what happens? It, it removes some of your very own lashes. Facts. And while it will grow back, it will take a while. And so using a product like our castor oil mascara will help to boost the growth and help to thicken it while it grows. So you want to use this on your lashes and your brows just to keep them looking thick and healthy right 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 <laughs> all right so you guys can order the products individually or you can order them as a gift set with all three products and when you order the set we do send you a nice like a free gift item yes and we do send it to you in a nice gift box package so it's also suitable as a gift if you want to gift it to someone all right so on to our body care we have handcrafted soap handmade soaps you guys and you can see based on the imperfection of the cutting that these are as organic as it gets yes this is not factory made these are hand poured and made with with what Love. With love. Why, why are you forcing me to say this? Just leave me out of your conversation. Like All right, guys. So, so far we have, mm -hmm, and I'm going to tell you which one of these are. Anybody can guess which of these is our top seller? Yeah. We have a top seller and we have a second top seller, but anybody can guess which one, which two are our top sellers. Then, yeah. All right. So, we have the eucalyptus mint um, fragrance. We have the activated charcoal and turmeric soap bar. We have the turmeric sea moss soap bar. And we have the ingredient that we're now cooking with. You know how bomb that soap here is. Because we'll cook with the ingredient. And the ingredient is also in our soap. We have the lemongrass um, soap bar. So yeah, so the thing said. So these guys you want to get your hands on these because it will change the dynamic of your skin <laughs> oh god official jamie said the activated charcoal close enough that's our second runner up yeah that's our second the activated charcoal is actually the second um fastest selling soap that we have but the the one that takes takes the win is our turmeric sea soap yes turmeric sea moss all right guys so you can follow us as i said on instagram and you can also shop at our on our etsy shop at www.etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash one true natural again www.etsy.com forward slash shop forward slash one true natural it is being added to the chat as we speak so that you can conveniently click on it once we are done but yeah mm -hmm. for the thing set um let me see if i can get some of these comments you are right, some peas, yam and banana. I see you have carrots, asparagus, and Brussels sprouts. Yes, Delano, these are going to be added to the fish. So this is a part of the the protein, not the um the staple. A staple, you call it hard to starch. Whatever. Plantains, no. Rev, you still have the oh. Good morning to you. Good morning, Vera McIntosh. Good morning, Denise Williams. You are, you're kind of late-ish, but things cooking still are going. Why are you guys cooking? Fried dumpling? Fried dumpling? No. The products are wonderful. Thanks, Damia. What's the Instagram name, please? Instagram name is One True Natural. Follow us. The CMOS, yes. All right, guys, so now we are cooking. We have a wok that is fired up. Mm -hmm. 
and the Brussels sprouts and the carrot added with some uh, everything bagel seasoning and now he's putting some garlic powder a very favorite of the Yada Bella kitchen And this is just to get a quick stir on them. We just want them to be nice and toasty, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. And our fish is basically done, you know. So Ooh. I'm just going to try to remove some of the water from that. I'm hoping that they don't fall apart. Why are you just taking out the water? Because come it's on. the poaching liquid. You're not, you're not going to use the poaching liquid to make the, the sauce. You're going to drizzle the sauce over them. Mm. So, um... There's something about cooking with a wok that makes people look like them can cook when they use a wok, right? Who said that? Me. Oh, so, but see, uh, you know some can cook when you must be like that. I'm not talking you. I mm -hmm. said people. Yeah, you're yeah, sure you're more talking. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Way, Dion Banks, you are the winner. You are the winner. Nobody still don't get the answer, so we will see when we plate it. <coughs> and you know, so it, can, it can be done with just this alone, right? I mean, I mean you, you don't have to add no, no staple. Of course. This can be it. Like what Delano said, you know? Mm -hmm. But the lano, we have to, we have to, we have to, we have to add the staple. Due to all we never eat no dinner yesterday. We never eat all day yesterday. Why are you tell the people them these things? Because we didn't. You don't tell them these things, dear. For why? Because them mother feel like so we don't eat no food at their time. You have to tell them, you have to talk like, oh, because yesterday we had um fuzzy fuzzy fur for dinner. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now you add your onion. And guys, if you're one of those people who cook your veggies until they're soft, then you're cooking it wrong. I'm just putting it out there. We're gonna leave the people then let them cook all they want. Your veggies go. should be nice and crunchy. And al dente. Al dente. Firm yet tender. Leave the people there. Vegetables them. closet. Big up yourself, girl. Good morning. Uh, we're making poached fish. Now we're sauteing our veggies over here. And I'm still looking good. My neighbor cut me the stove top, yes? Wow. There you go. Shut up, my door. Yeah, cut the stove top. <laughs> No man, watch your pipe bubble. People. <laughs> we don't leave me alone my girl. Watch your pot cover. <laughs> no sir. I mean so fancy. You already you get quiet, you know. <laughs> Yell me. How old that? Mitchell's closet. Mitchell man chop. Sure. <laughs> you don't just see I'm 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 doing high cuisine cooking. I can't talk to Regular people, because I'm cooking He's high cooking cuisine. Hot cuisine dishes. You have to understand um, okay. the closet when when you're He's, in. He has to focus. Yeah, when you're at the levels where I'm at right now. Mm -hmm. You have to, you have to, you can't really talk up to turn everybody. Turn this down. Yeah, turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Sorry. Turn it right off. Mm -hmm. Let me spin it one more time just so that it not give me no trouble. Catch it! 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 Sure. Sure. All right. Let's reach and run over here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, sir. So now I'm adding in my garlic. Mm -hmm. Garlic, guys. And I put some, um, some, um, what do you call it? Olive oil down. Because, you know. Mm hmm. I'm just warming. Waiting for the stove to come up to temperature, the right. pot. Family. 
I'll eat this if I'm bleed. Love my mama and daddy, send me hunt. Let my continent eat with Aunt Amelia. <laughs> Watch. <laughs> Watch your boy. Remember. Mm -mm. <laughs> eat, your, eat up your, your oatmeal, yeah? Yeah? I'll watch, and then you make this for dinner. Don't show the people them in my pot. Why are you going towards my pot, my girl? Sneak peek at what's coming in another video. Sneak peek! If I never see some things we add to this, it's not your typical um it's not your typical pineapple skin juice. I can just tell you that. Alright, so you're gonna turn this all the way down. Mm -hmm. And you're gonna add your butter. Butter. And you want to add enough butter to make a nice little sauce right because it's a garlic butter right so mm. the butter for sure yeah mm. and you add some lemon juice because you I don't want the butter to you don't want the butter to break vera mcintosh you can come for some you definitely can come for some This is how you get the butter to not break. I mean break. Break as in turn source of oil. Oh. You don't want source of oil. No. So you how you get that to not break by just lifting it off of the pot? Yeah. And then I have a little bit of the poaching liquid. Mm. Just a little bit. And just keep stirring that like such. And then you have your scallions. Mm-hmm. Well, you'll be able to like gourmet, Chef. Yeah, try my man. Try in my life. You have to try some things in my life, you know. I don't like when the pot cover is, the, the handle is out. Because you could bounce it. You have to try some things in my life, me I tell you. If you don't try in my life, you know, not win in my life. Guys, this is the making of the garlic butter sauce. And put some cilantro. Cilantro now. We move, yeah. <laughs> we are moving. See that, guys? See it? It's a break. See it? It's a break. All right. So that's it. I can add a little bit more butter. Just a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Alright. Now I'm never see if we can do any type of creating. Because where the where the top for this the boo? Alright, so while he gets ready to do the plating question, have you guys had any thought recently about weight loss? I'm pretty sure at least five people are thinking that they need to lose some weight. <clears throat> have you ever thought <clears throat> recently that you want to get your body detoxed? That's everybody, because we all need to get rid of the toxins that are in our body. So, mm -hmm. guys, the solution is right here. <laughs> Green Valley Detox, One Day Detox, Powerhouse Herbal Supplement, from my ancestors to you. Mm -hmm. And this is for your health. Your health is great wealth. This product, you guys, and many of people on the chat have tried it. 
many of the subscribers have ordered and reordered many, many, many times because of the effectiveness, the efficacy Jeez, of this oh, here product, guys. Trust me, this product is designed to actually clean out your, your bowels because sometimes we are not as regular as we should be. Sometimes we, we have days, we, we go days without going to the bathroom. That's very unhealthy. You should be going to the bathroom multiple times per day. And so for that reason, all of this decomposed food, we're walking around with undigested. A, yes, undigested um, decomposing food is in our stomachs and we need to get it out. And this product, guys, work like magic. Why? Because it doesn't involve you boiling tea for multiple days. It doesn't in, in involve you... Um, inserting anything and adding water to anywhere and doing anything it just involves you drinking this small bottle of herb goodness some of the ingredients are water moringa dandelion king of the forest sawasap leaf guinea hen weed jack in the bush inflammation weed leaf of life aloe vera which um tuna which is prickly pear garlic vervain and star of anise and cinnamon these are all all natural ingredients there's not one artificial or you know chemically um induced <laughs> ingredient in this it's just a bottle of herbs that you drink one go and believe you me within a matter of minutes and that is why it is recommended that you stay home on a day when you take it because you know it will get to work almost immediately and you will have uh, um the occasion where everything that is in your stomach will be oh. eradicated <laughs> yeah so guys if you want to order this you can text us at 305 204 1270 305 204 1270. All right, and this is shipped to you for free if you're in the US for sure, for sure, for sure. And um, yeah, awesome, awesome, awesome product. This is another one. It is our um, blood purifier. This is more of a supplement. This is not a one go um, product. This is one that you take every morning. You take four ounces at a time and it is amazing for dealing with some um, health issues such as acid reflux, um, diabetes, heartburns, hot flashes, erectile dysfunction, and so on and so forth. This again is all natural and has all natural ingredients, right? So again, go ahead, shoot us a text and we will definitely ship it off to you ASAP. So the thing said. So never have a problem, babe. What's the problem? My fish is totally um, broken down. What caused that? Eh? It was too long, I guess. I didn't, you know, so me, me, me can't find pieces intact enough. We have to, enough on the plate still. We have enough on the plate? Mm-hmm. Ah, I don't like when my things them don't work out enough because she means a Prosecco now. Mm-hmm. But so that's guys, really good, man. Like, somebody pay for it. So guys, this is one of the problems with my, my fish now. Um, what Dion? Dion, so Dion, this artist, uh, L. Dion Banks, you do drink the whole bottle if it's the cleanse that you're doing. Yes, you drink the entire, it's just eight ounces and um, it does taste herby. Yeah, mm -hmm. oh, so now you're you're spooning on the um, the garlic butter, so mm -hmm. and that's pretty much what you want to do. You know, you just want to add your garlic butter sauce in and around. Mm -hmm. You know, make everything get a little drizzle. And poached fish is a way healthier um, cooking method than yeah, even very much stewing. So. 
very much so very much so mm -hmm. you know. but guys this is the finished result how it look guys as i said before my fish my fish didn't hold its integrity as i had anticipated i think my problem was i poached it too long doing all the other stuff um and so bear with me on that note mm -hmm. oh my god it tastes so good mm -hmm. wow. mm -mm. it tastes good yeah baby mm -hmm. this look like a fine dining plating i'm not even gonna lie this look good this look like it looks delicious thanks official jamia yes breadfruit no <laughs> guys it's, it's rice <laughs> this is our rosemary rice underneath <laughs> rosemary Ooh, rosemary rice <laughs> Lashon, I didn't know you were on. Good morning to you, girl. Good morning. And long time we not see Troy, cause Troy busy, so we can't get no plating price nowadays. Emilia, the price Lala. is for Instagram. What's the price, Lala? So bright and fresh. And so, guys, that's our offering for today. We just tried our best to make a quickly poached dish. Um, again, sometimes we don't want the frying. Sometimes we don't want the whole a waga waga, you know. Um, the reason why rice was introduced was was because we were. This is the one meal that we're gonna make for the day, mm -hmm. you know. We were not planning to make any other meal. No, you can replace the shrimp, the fish with shrimp, you know, or you can use a sturdier shrimp um, fish, you know, something with um, with bones. Mm -hmm. um, there are so many so, so much options presented to you for this one. Mm -hmm. So we do hope that you would try it in your neck of the woods. You know, and um, yeah, just trying my best. Twenty-five to thirty dollars, Lala says. Mm -hmm. Use up your Brussels sprouts. Um, I just recently watched a clip with Doctor Sebi, and Doctor Sebi is saying, "Oh, you know, we need um one one wedge of lemon on it." Doctor Sebi is saying that um we must avoid broccoli and cauliflower because those two are not naturally grown, like oh, we, you know, it's not it's not a natural um product, and so. We are trying to you introduce different stuff. The Brussels sprouts is super duper good, and the asparagus is very, very, very good for um, people who have water retention. You know, so the asparagus can help you to remove the water from your system. That's why, whenever you, well, let's leave that alone. Asparagus, um, <laughs> tomatoes again, they are nightshades. Um, they have potassium in them, and so if you have potassium deficiencies, you can you utilize the tomatoes. Uh, Brussels sprouts are superfoods and they have a whole host of nutrients in them as well and so you can add those and the fish is just filler to be honest with you the cod is just filler um, it's better to use this than to use salted cod and so we utilize it in like if we're making ackee and saltfish we use this instead and um, and um, you know we just again trying to do something different and something unique so so check us out cut off the top check us out um on yada belly tv like share subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend I, again I, I i do wish that my fish would have stood up a little bit longer and hold the shape so that i could present like one major piece across the top and all of those things but hey it's a real channel we have here and it's not a fake channel so we are cooked the food for real that's good babes so there it is. Oh, look, babes. You like it? Yeah, man. Grab one look a plate and try some. Grab one look a plate and try some quick. Grab one look a plate and Yeah, and it, it not take no whole time. Um, from start to finish the video, we have done just 45 minutes. You know, so it's worth trying, you know, worth trying something. Yeah. Yeah, man, you like it. It look good. Yeah. Joshua, can I get this for your lunch? Before I'm going to work. So guys, once again, this is Yada Belly TV, and we are doing what we are doing. Thank you so much for joining us this morning, you know, and we hope that you will stick and stay and keep yourself locked in to Yada Belly TV as we do more and more and more and more and more. My girl, you take a long to prepare one little plate though. Cheese and peas.
that no, that no, that no, absolutely have to be in, in a hit too. You don't have to put all the vegetables in the middle of the testing plate. Guys, you have to put all the vegetables in the testing plate. I think so. Everything. I think you have to put everything in the testing plate. Why? Alright, I'm going to taste the fish, which is the main event. Tell me if it tastes good. Don't burn yourself in a card, I laugh on camera. Mm hmm How the fish tastes? Give me some some culinary terms. Tastes bombastic. <laughs> That's not a culinary term. <laughs> That's not a culinary term. It's nice and fresh and um you can taste that nice garlicky buttery flavor. Right, with right, right. Sauce. And then the little lemon with the kick. The little hint of citrusness from the the thing and the thing. The mm -hmm. lemon that you added. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I may have something to say, ask them both. Well, we can't eat this way. Guys, Welcome. can you guys tell me what can we have this with? Because we have it, right? This is, this is um caviar. Dion Banks. What can we have with this? Hold on, sorry. I got to do a whole video because I never eat caviar from me, Bon. Anybody on my vlog who eat caviar, please tell us how we go about eating caviar the right way. I promise you, I like, I like eating. Do we just dip it into it and start chew and, and eat? Or do we, do we do something special? Fish or seafood? Um, I don't understand, um, Jamia. Fish or seafood. Oh. oh, eat it with fish or seafood? Mm -hmm. Salmon. Eat the caviar with salmon. Mm, I guess that's what they do. They tap it. Oh. Probably put it as a topping on something. Maybe I go buy a pack of water crackers. And just beat it with some water crackers. You know, you know what? You know what? You know what? Mm -hmm. So we just so like 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 we just make the seafood, however, like a garlic butter, salmon, something light. Because if we do something strong, would this would it not take away the, the flavor of this? Put it on a poach fish. Put it on a poach fish. Mm -hmm. I mean, yes, top it. Dian Bank says top it. So look out for that caviar video. I come up. Um, Megos, Megos, see how it, how it, what it, what it tastes like. Anybody can tell me what it tastes like. Anybody out there who have tried the caviar can tell me what it tastes like. While caught in the cold coastal waters of Iceland, served well chilled. Try it on your fish now. Yes, tap it. But it's a must chill it. It's a must chill it. Lump fish roe, salt and water. So they're different. Tell me you're gonna be yeah, fish. Yeah, you have sturgeon, which is expensive, deer. Sturgeon fish are the dearest. Black sturgeon or something like that. It's deer oh, bad. <laughs> Guys, you see how she came out of something and then when she don't know, she going to ask me. Jamia said pop in your mouth. Jamia, 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 I'm not eating it then. Nothing not supposed to pop in my mouth. <laughs> no, so, no, sir. Prayer kid, you hear Jamia say it pop in my mouth. No, Jamia, Jamia, you just lose me a while ago. <laughs> your web venture about it tastes nasty like poison. <laughs> oh, <no laughs> so, guys, see there. And in true to form, it's little black um, fish eggs. Oh, True yeah. to you know, but yeah, me, me not me not really comfortable with the popping them out part, Jamia. I think I'm not gonna have it. I'm gonna give it to her. <laughs> <laughs> no sir, oh no no, catch me around here. No, it's not happening. Prayer kid, where's the men on the vlog? Cause these men need to stand in my defense. You understand? Official Jamia says something that I really can't work with. Eh? Jamaican men are the only one with the problem. No, sir. No other man not upon the vlog. 
I need the man to come on and, and talk to me because it, yes, this is true. Pops in mouth, a salty pop. No, no, guys, I'm not, guys, I'm not changing my mind about this thing now. Eh? I'm not changing my mind after this thing. I'm not bothered to no caviar. If, no, if nothing not popping and no mouth around here. Mm -mm. Tastes good in me. I feel like I eat something meaningful. Mm -hmm. Like more foreign and get a foreign food. Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Guys, it tastes so good. Trust me. So, as of now, I don't really cut down the amount of broccoli when I eat and, and cauliflower. I never really like cauliflower from day one. Dr. Sebi says cauliflower is is um is artificial it has nothing in it by way of nutrients mm -hmm. and that's why it come out white you understand and it was made Accent. no win some never ask i'm gonna ask win some you understand nobody now give me nothing with pop in my mouth pop <laughs> 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 Nah, uh -uh. no sir so. let me eat my fish up my swim around guys it's worth trying not a whole lot of spicy spicy flavor it's just nice and it, it make you want more mm -hmm. done it yeah so the vegetables are Nice and crunchy. Okay. I like it. I like it a lot. And guys, anytime I eat this, it reacts to my body immediately. Asparagus. That's how I know it's good. Me and asparagus have a relationship going. And we limit the amount of rice that we eat on any given basis. And so, when we're eating rice like this now, we eat early, you know, before 12. So we can get this out of our body by an evening, we don't have to worry about it. And we drink a lot of tea. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Guys, thank you so much for joining us today. So if you eat on top. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. They don't have a whole lot of different powder powder seasoning. It just it and just tastes natural. Unpretentious. Yeah. It just tastes yardy belly. Nice, fresh. It's just ingredients. fresh and, and just oh. Mm -hmm. So guys, this is how we take our leave. Nice. Let me show you something first. So we're in the process of growing. Pineapples. These are organic pineapples. Mm -hmm. And we got them from our neighbor's tree. You remember the neighbor them were always born down? Matella mm -hmm. said all bad things end up with some good result. You understand? No matter how bad it is, some good result come out of it because they found somewhere else to live and they move and they left the pineapple. And so ever so often I look through my window. And if I see anything look yellow, I run go over there in the bushes and grab one of the pineapple. <laughs> and now we're trying to grow them. See? One, two, three, four. So little more than now the backyard I got have pineapple. We can start selling you a pineapple. And then the wifey is trying with this carrot. Look at this guys. But I think this is rabbit food, cause the rabbit them under the shed are gonna name this. I know that. If you try to grow this carrot, they're not going to it. So right now we're waiting on the pineapples to catch um, root. Can, can carrots be grown in a pot? Let me know. Yes, I would just plant it in a pot. And keep it on like the back porch or something. I don't know. I'm, I mean, maybe. Maybe carrot can grow in the pot. I know because I'm not trying to fight no rabbits. The, the rabbit they must eat too. The, you can't fight out yeah. government rabbit. The Jesus made the rabbit the man said go hand the on a shed. And the rabbit they must try to eat. So leave them. <laughs> right? Ever so often we see the rabbit them run across the screen. Okay. And guys, I'm growing ginger. Whoa! 
if you ever see my ginger, mm -hmm. yeah, and the mango tree, my say we have a mango tree, we have a coconut tree, we have a guava tree, they must struggle, but well, them apple still. Tree. Them, the apple um, tree. The apple tree. The apple tree. The apple tree. Yeah, I think so. Hold on. Oh, to eat the apple without there, and it did a fight, the good fight, but it give up the ghost. So where is it? You dig it up? No, it, it just disappear. Wow. I feel so hurt. What's the, What's the number again? Can you type it in, please? The number for the detox. The number for the detox. The number for the detox is 305-204-1270. That's 305-204-1270. All right, guys. So once again, we thank you so much for joining us today. As I said, our our dish didn't come out a hundred percent like I personally had wanted it to, but we give thanks to the Lord anyway because He is still good. So, guys, thank you for joining us today. And guess what? We're gonna do it again. And look out for more videos coming out. We're gonna be doing this again pretty soon. Until then, take a last look and guys, just thank you once again for being a part of Daddy Belly TV. We love you all and peace out. Have bless. Have you tried growing golden seal? Me not know what is golden seal. No butter. <laughs> you can't grow butter. Me <laughs> 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 don't know what is golden seal. <laughs> all right, so I'll be on radio this afternoon at 5 p.m. and my program is called vitamin b and tracy good morning to you tracy and so guys remember let me oh my lord um i check see me can type in the radio um i type in the radio something in the chat so that you guys if you are in and around the the neighborhood you can watch it all right so the program is to be in and around the neighborhood me just i say Wherever you are in the world, you can tune in. At 5 p.m. for Vita, Vitamin B Show. All right, so there is the website for Vitamin B Show. You can join us um, this evening at 5. Tracy, me I try to cook some fish and the fish don't work out. It I broke up and all these things and so. I have to go rescue it and do something else with it because it broke apart in the pot and so I can't serve it like somebody want to serve it. So, you know it got ready. So, look at it though. It look good. I tell you, it looks so good. I can't take the late people, let me know. You know what? Tracy, only come on because you see the plates. Don't you see? Mm. Or go on your Alexa. Yeah. Uh, yes, and you can type in, um, well, the Alexa, ha you have to, you have to um, link your Alexa. She still want fear one and two detox. Come feet. By the time you come, it will be ready. So guys, once again, this is our presentation for today. We do hope that you will like, share, subscribe, tell a friend. To tell a friend that Yardabella TV is attempting greatness in the comfort of his own little kitchen. So join us again as we present another meal from Yadibelli TV. And guess what? Holy past stuff is going on. Don't worry about the look. It's the taste that matters. Delano Brown, thank you so much here, brother, brother. I want to tell us it tastes good here. It tastes, <laughs> let me tell us it tastes good. It tastes good here. You see me? But I got probably add, like how Tracy, Tracy trims. Tracy trims. Oh, yeah. Tracy eat trims. Yes, that diet changed from day to day. I don't know what she's eating. She said yes. That means I'm not putting none in there. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> oh my God. Tracy. I'm not putting none in there, Tracy. Can you eat this? <laughs> <laughs> Guys, once again, thank you for joining us. We are right at the one hour mark. And it's, I love it. I love it. I love it. Um, remember to stick and stay. Yada Belly TV. Like and share and tell somebody. Tag me in your food videos and let me watch them. Because we like on a certain. And if you don't have a YouTube channel that is up and running now, now post on them something. Then let us know. I have one. Natural hair namics. 
Oh, follow my wife here at Natural Hair Dynamics. Her channel is about um, hair care and them um, something there. Here's Let me type it in. Natural hair, this and hair Natural Hair Dynamics. That's it. So that's the wife's channel, Natural Hair Dynamics. All right. So follow her and she do wally pass up and show them your ear again. Bounce it, girl. Bounce with it, bounce with it, bounce with it. I said to bounce with it, bounce with it. You know, say so you're full, right? <laughs> Look how you make me a turn in a idiot. <laughs> no, sir. She <laughs> am bad. Uh. Mm? She just said that they are bouncer. <laughs> Until that time when we link again, the Lord bless you and keep you and make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up his countenance upon each and every one of you and give you all his peace. Continue to love up Jesus and Jesus will continue to love. Uno up. In Jesus' name. Very much in touch. Good morning to you. Blessings to you. And well, just on a prayer for winner, I could come live quite regular. I could do some ice cream. You want to do ice cream later? Well, come on live later on in the night. And I promise on this time, we are going to do ice cream. Remember, later yeah, on in the night. I'm making it in Jesus' name. Hot color, blue, yeah, brand down. Jesus' name? Yeah. I have to do it. I come on live this evening. Guys, watch out. You have the belly TV. I come on live. Make sure you ring the notification bell. Because we come on live in Jesus' name. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hi, ooh. All right, guys. I'm gone. <laughs> oh, my Lord. It's pretty, man.